Hello dear students, let's check out this particular question now. In this question, three rings each of mass m and radius r are so placed that they touch each other as shown in the figure. The moment of inertia of the system about the axis O, O dash is. So, let this particular ring be ring number 1, this be 2 and this is 3. The radius of the ring is r and the mass of each ring is m. Okay, students, I need to calculate the moment of inertia of the system, of this complete system about an axis passing through O, O dash. So, students, for ring number 1, for ring number 1, you can see that the axis is passing through the center of the ring. So, moment of inertia of the ring about center of mass is given by m r square by 2. Okay. Now, for ring 2 and 3, for ring 2 and 3, the moment of inertia will be same. Moment of inertia of ring 2 will be equal to moment of inertia of ring 3. And if I closely examine ring number 2, the axis of rotation is passing through here. Here is O dash and O. Okay. So, I know that for ring number 2, moment of inertia can be calculated by using parallel axis theorem. So, by parallel axis theorem, What I can write? I can write I2 is equal to I center of mass plus if this distance is d, m into d square. Okay, because I need to calculate the moment of inertia of this ring 2 and 3 about an axis which is passing through the tangent of the ring. So, moment of inertia of a ring about center of mass is given by mr square by 2 and the value of d is equal to r, so it will be mr square. So, moment of inertia of ring 2 is equal to moment of inertia of ring 3, which will come out to be 3 mr square by 2. So, for the system, if I need to calculate the moment of inertia, it will come out to be i1 plus i2 plus i3. i1 is what? I1 is mr square by 2. I2 is what? 3 by 2 mr square and I3 is also same. So, this will be 7 mr square by 2. Okay, students. So, moment of inertia of the system about an axis O, O dash is given by 7 by 2 m r square. Let us check the solution now. So, option number 4 is the correct answer here. I hope this is clear to all of you. Thank you.